What is up, everybody? It's your boy Chris Cage coming at you two times, and it's time now for Hot Wheels All Out. We are racing realistic cars in Block H, and we're gonna see who will come out on top in today's race because we got a lot of cool cars getting ready to get on the track and, and get to going on here. And as always, big shout out to everybody who is watching uh, this live as a premiere. Just know that you can uh, comment in the little gimmick that says live chat and you can live chat during this race. You can say whatever you want and plus also react as I'm showing you the cars that are racing and all that. But as with all Hot Wheels All Out races are always sponsored by the Sunflower Company. Of the only small business gift shop that's that's right by my best seat so where you'll be able to find sunflower theme items and non sunflower theme items hell um i mean she even makes necklaces and keychains that that need to go so go buy a keychain from her that's my plug for you anyways it's time to get going with the whole shebang and it's time now to start round number one of hot was all out real cars block h let's get it It's round number one, everybody, and you know what that means. It's time to try on the finish line for those famous words. Hot Wheels Racers, take your lane! All right, here we go. Here's your first heat. Let's see who wins it. Winner, lane two. We're going to lane two, and your winner is the Custom 7 Ford Mustang. Your winner in lane one is a Ford GTLM by Golf. Winner, lane three. Your winner in lane three is the 10 Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake. Winner, lane two. Your winner in lane two is the BMW M3 E30. Go to lane two for your winner, and it's the 69 Charger. Winner, lane three. Your winner is the 57 Chevy in lane three. Winner, lane five. Going to lane five, we have the Corvette Grand Sport Roadster. Your winner in lane two is the 11 Dodge Charger RT. It looks like it's a plastic version. Winner, lane two. Your winner in lane two is the Mitsubishi Eclipse. Winner, lane three. Your winner is the Lamborghini Esto in lane three. Winner, lane one. The winner in lane one is this Mercedes-Benz A45 AMG, I think it is. Okay, minor correction, it was the 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class. But here's your next race. Going to lane two, I think it's a Mercedes-Benz 500 SL. Winner, lane four. Your winner in lane four is a 67 Ford Mustang GT. Winner, lane three. Your winner in lane three is a Aston Martin V8 Vantage. Lane 
Your winner in lane four is the 2017 Camaro ZL1. We got the 70 Roadrunner 50th Anniversary Race Team Edition getting the win. Winner, We're going to lane 5 for your winner, and it's the Ford GT40. Your winner in lane two is this 2009 Ford F-150, and I think this one was a former Hot Wheels All Out winner. Winner, lane six. Looks like you can't handle them buffers right there. Your winner is the Monte Carlo concept car that's been raised up as part of High Rakers. Your winner in lane one is the 67 Chevelle SS 396. Winner, lane four. Your winner in lane four is the 15, 2015 Mazda MX-5 Miata. Your winner in lane 5 is the 69 Ford Mustang. Winner, lane two. Your winner in lane 2 is the Porsche 911 uh, GT3 RS. Your winner in lane six goes to this beautiful black 68 Mercury Cougar. I really like this version. Winner, lane six. We go back to lane six for your winner, and it's the Dodge Challenger Drift Car. Your winner in lane three is the eight, or, or no, or not eight. It is the Dodge Charger SRT8. That was an 08 version. Never mind. Winner, lane five. Your winner in lane five is this Escort Rally. This is a newer one, but with the older tooling on it. Winner in lane three is the Datsun 240Z. Winner, lane five. Your winner in lane five is the Mitsubishi E or no, the Mitsubishi Eclipse Eclipse concept car. Your winner in lane three is the um, Cadillac El Mirage. Winner, lane two. The winner, the winner in lane two is the 92 Ford Mustang. Your winner in lane two is the, I think it's a 2015 Ford Mustang GT convertible. Winner, lane two. Your winner in lane two is the Celine S7. Winner in lane one is the um, 95, 1995 Camaro. Winner, lane three. 
winner is lane three, and it goes to the 68 Shelby GT500. Your winner in lane three is the McLaren P1. Winner, lane four. Your winner in lane four is the Datsun 240Z. And this time it's in blue. Your winner in lane one, it goes to the 64 Riviera. Winner, lane six. Your winner is in lane six, and it is this uh, Shelby Cobra Daytona Coupe. And this is why I say the D100 doesn't roll good on these wheels because this one was slow. It should be on these wheels that this um, Cobra Daytona Coupe has. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one is the Datsun 240Z. A third one has won so far. Your winner in lane two is the BMW 850i. Winner, lane five. Your winner in lane five goes to the custom 69 Chevy. Your winner in lane one goes to the 68 El Camino. Winner, lane four. Your winner in lane four is the 58 Corvette or blown 58 Corvette. Your winner in lane three is the 50 or 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. Got a couple of Land Rovers in this race. Let's see who wins this. None of them did, but we got a duplicate Corvette Grand Sport Roadster with the win. Winner in lane one goes to the BMW Z4M. Winner, lane one. Winner in lane one is the 84 Mustang SVO. Winner, lane four. Your winner in lane four goes to the 07 Shelby GT500. Going to lane three for your winner, and it is the 70 or 70 Firebird Racing Edition. Second to the last race. Winner, lane one. 11 Dodge Charger RT in lane one gets the win. Here's your final five. Time to see who'll move on to the next round. Your winner will be the Corvette C6R in lane number four. And just like that, round one is over. So here are all the cars that have moved on to round number two. Got a lot of good castings right here. Including a few Datsun 240Zs made it in here as well too. A yellow, a blue, and a red one. So primary colors basically. No secondaries. Plus you got these two right here. And here they all are. And there you have it, round one in the books, which means round two will start up next.
round two, everybody, and here's your first six. Winner, lane three. Your winner in lane three is the 2009 Ford F-150. Your winner in lane two is the BMW M3 E30. Winner, lane one. The Shelby Cobra Daytona Coupe gets the win. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one is the 1995 Camaro. Winner in lane five is the Ford GT LM. Oh, there was a three-way for the win right here. It was between the Vantage, the Mustang, and another Mustang, but the S Martin V8 Vantage comes out on top. Winner in lane one. Oh, look, the same thing has happened in a previous race where cars are standing next to each other. Your winner in lane one is the Mitsubishi Eclipse. Second to the last race. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one is the 70 Pontiac Firebird Race Team Edition. Here's your final four. Time to see who will move on to the finals. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one is a 7 Shelby GT500 that is upside down. I'll place the right side up because we got ourselves nine cars moving on, as you see right here. And these nine cars are going to compete in the finals right about now. All right, guys, finals. Time to see who will compete in the gauntlet. Winner, lane one. I think we may have a repeat winner here as this F-150 gets the win. Let's see who will face the F-150 and maybe lose because that car is fast in the gauntlet. Yeah, that's my I have no faith for the, for, for the other car kicking in. I really am like that on YouTube. But let's see if this Mitsubishi Eclipse is any match for the 2009 Ford F-150. Now, when the orange one won, uh, that, or when the orange one won all out way back in the day, it was a formidable force. So as I said, you might as well just start getting 2009 Ford F-150s because you'll be killing it in... In, in the downhill aspect of diecast racing. But anyways, here's your gauntlet. Let's get them on the track. We got the F-150 taking on the Eclipse. We've got a Ford truck versus a JDM tuner. Let's see who will become the all-out winner. Winner, lane two. The F-150 gets the win. Let's see if we can do it again on the opposite side. And just like that, Hot Wheels All Out is done. Your winner for, I don't know if it's the second or third time this year, is this 2009 Ford F-150. He is your Hot Wheels All Out Real Estate Cars Block H winner. I mean, look at it. I mean, it is built for racing. And plus, as I said earlier... Usually, this casting does very well in downhill racing competition with the likes of the school bus and the Ferrari F40. And also, my favorite, the GT Racer, which will be racing pretty soon when we, when we have Fantasy Cars Block I going. But, regardless of which, big shout out to the 2009 Ford F-150 for claiming dominance yet again. 
as he won it for the F-150. And that will do it for today's Hot Wheels All Out Race. As I said before, but I'll say it again. Next time that we will see you, we'll be racing cars in Block I, starting with Fantasy Cars. So stay tuned for that. And that will do it for today's Hot Wheels Race. I hope you liked this video. Give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. If you are brand new watching this, be sure you subscribe and also turn on the notifications bell as well. It's your boy Chris Cage. I'm coming at you two times and we will see you at the next race.